Hey everybody, the Forehead 27 currently here kicking your ass in Game of War. Right now we're back with the Road to Gold series. At the moment, we are in Silver 1, popped with a 33 LP after playing a few games, lost a couple, won a couple. Basically, it's kind of funny. My win rates that go along with this entire rank season are pretty much like 88% win rate as Camille and under 50 for everyone else that wasn't one game. So I may need to start trying to play different champions. I gotta stop playing Poppy because I thought that Poppy would be okay, but I have like a 17% win rate out of six games. I've won like one. So I'm, I'm done playing that champion. No more of that. We're going to keep playing Camille if possible. But if I can't actually get her... I was thinking about Fiora, if not Fiora, maybe Aurelia. I think Aurelia might be a better idea because we become a little bit more tankier than normal. Anyway, enough talking. Let's go ahead and get started with the first game. Well, go. my man Camille. Okay, we're going to try Aurelia. You know, I just realized I'm trying to play Camille and Camille gets banned. And so now I picked Aurelia. So I'm basically the new G-Bay or G-Bay like 1.5 or 0.5. I don't know. I'm not as good at him as Aurelia. So maybe I'm actually Gbay.5. Or as I like to refer to it, Gbay49.5. Sorry. So the enemy team, we have Akali top lane as well as Hecarim jungle, Nivea mid, Jin and Thresh bot lane. For myself, it's a Shivana jungle, Gangplank mid with a mastery level 7, if I may add. A Draven and Alistar bot lane. Now, I don't... I did have to download a certain patch, but I don't remember if this is the specific patch or not. So I'm a little bit worried because I'm not quite sure if Draven got the buffs or not or, or what changed really. But regardless, at least uh, at least we're in the game and we're going to do our very best. I not sure if you're supposed to start W or E. Oh, I think you're actually supposed to start E on Aurelia. Oops. Oh, her name is Riven or Troll. Oh, she's not playing Riven, so I don't know what the fuck's going on there. Oh, she's in the minion aggro. But she got me, bursted me down way faster than I thought she would. Especially for an Akali early game. I didn't think she'd have this much damage. I could probably do okay against Akali to start off with. It's just the fact that she has those damn Q and auto attack combos. I didn't think they would do that much damage so early on. Oh shit, we just got Ocean Drake. Damn, that was fast. I think Siobhan actually soloed it. Oh shit, I might die. Oh, I'm okay. Holy shit, I lived. All right, we're okay, but she definitely forced me out of lane because of that. God damn, really has 355 base movement speed. That's so high. Well, Akali and I are about even farm. She's roughly... Oh, she obviously ahead of me because of the early kill, though. But in the sense of just, like, CS, we're actually pretty close. Oh, kick ass. Balling got a kill. And that means he got the extra gold for the adoration stacks thanks to Draven. Ooh, I can lane sustain really easy just so long as I attack... Sir, oh shit. I'm okay. Oh, maybe I'm not okay. Come on, go in, go in on me. Oh, oh I wanted it. Shenanigans may be uh, happening down the bot lanes. Oh dear. Ooh. This looks like some fun ass shenanigans. I'm liking these shenanigans. Let's go. Okay, can I... I don't know where I'm supposed to go here. I'm just gonna go this way. All I want is, like, to hurt to hurt the fucking thing. There we go. Okay, I got assist gold, I suppose. But I'm gonna lose top lane tower. I don't know. It seemed like an okay teleport, but... I am gonna lose top because of... Oh, maybe I won't, actually. She's taking that shit pretty fucking slowly. Oh, can I? Coke, do you think I can? No! Oh, are you kidding me? I so had that too. Oh, that's so tilting. See, my regular auto attacks do a decent amount of damage. It's just the fact that she has Hextech Gunblade, which heals her for so much. But at the same time, once I pop ultimate, she's not that... God damn, my team is so good. Cloud Drake... And then they got Hecarim too. I don't know, you see, I, like, I just regen so much health. And so does she, but she regens health in major fights. I can... Oh, come on. Oh. Mmm. Luckily for me, Akali does not have any kind of, what's it called? Teleport. She only has Ghost and Flash. And because my ultimate is on such a ridiculously low cooldown, I can just start getting hits on this turret and getting free CS. However, here comes Akali. 
and I'm going to skedaddle out of here. What's with this? A competent jungler who takes objectives well, a really good mid laner, an excellent bot lane, and then the derpy ass top lane. At least I'm not farming a Kali. Uh oh, here come, oh, bot lane's having shit going down with the scrop. There we go, got my next level. Oh crap. Oh crap, we just lost. Oh, but they're so low. Please tell me she doesn't have egg. God damn it, she still had egg. Oh, can you do something cheeky, Gangplank? Oh, Gangplank, I'm expecting cheekiness. I believe in you, Gangplank. I believe in the cheeks. Oh, bot lane is so low, too. I say we murder somebody. An artist and his soul-crushing friend. This is a little bit scary. Our junglers have a lot of health. Oh, that's an interesting flash. All right. Well, this Hecarim is completely dead. And I know... Oh, crap. I may have gone too deep. That's perfectly fine, though. Hecarim went deep, got killed. And uh, Anivia has no egg. I knew we would find a mark Come on. Eventually. Shut up, Jin. I don't want to hear about your sassy art. I am a little bit scared though, because we've actually played these fights really well, but we played them mechanically well, you know? We haven't like, just brute forced our way through, and if we make weird plays, then brute forcing our way through won't be the option anymore. Oh, that was a really good wall. Oh, can you get her? Can you get her? Hell yeah, you can get her. Oh, okay, that that almost that almost tells me to the next fucking dimension the fact that he got based the mountain at the last second oh Nice oh shit. I've been noticed. Why do you say that in all chats? I don't I don't know what that, that whole deal was about all right things are going down All right, very slow. I want to I want to kill something. Never mind. Fucking holy shit, GP. I'm just going to slowly it very sl in fact like incredibly slowly attempt okay, thresh like I get it. No no f fuck the scuttle crab. Aha. Uh -huh. Well. 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 Help me, help me, Draven. I'm gonna stand behind you, Draven. I'm sorry. I, I'm sure you're a nice guy. Oh, wow. That was fast. Oh, my God, Draven. What a god. Okay. Uh. Uh. Oh, no way. That, that got a stun off. Yes. Stun? Yes. A redemption, though. Fuck. Oh, my God. No, 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 no. Oh, crap. Fucking Hecarim, holy shit. He went from f five and- or one and two to five and two. Okay, I need more magic resist. I think that Anivia hurts a lot, and so does this fucking Akali. But Akali does, like, split damage, if I recall. Shit! It was so good. Things were going so well. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. Okay, they're both going for me. Wait, what happened to Draven? How'd Draven die? Oh no, you guys gotta leave right now. This Akali- oh my god, this Akali is so tanky. I thought Tank Akali was nerfed, like, hard. What happened? Oh my god, Thresh. Oh! So good! But not enough. Oh my- oh, this is so close! Oh, my emotions are going up and down! Jin, there is no fucking way you can survive this. There's no way. Yeah, he's doomed. Yeah, he's doomed. And then, fucking... Oh, please, don't let him grab it. No! Yes! Yes, yes, yes. Okay. God, she just can hold that for like an hour. 
Oh no, this is a dead Draven if we don't do something here. Oh my god, okay, Anivia got fucking destroyed. There we go. Oh, come on, Akali! This invisibility shit is so dumb! Oh, nice one. Nice one! Oh, you're fucking dead, Shin, there's no way! There's no way I'm letting you out of here! Yes! She's gonna have to adjust her... storm. Oh, no she won't. God, she's good. She makes it so the minions fly into the storm. Oh. My. God. Alright, well if we can get anything in here, it's uh, we can kill the support. Oh, you're so fucking dead. Oh, you're so fucking dead, Anivia. Crap. Okay, we're okay. We got two of them. That, man, that was an awkward fight. What an awesome GP barrel. That's what started that shit, though. Once he hit that Jeep, that fucking barrel, he just did so much damage. Oh, I stunned the... I stunned the, the, uh, the Hecarim with that. You hear that auto attack canceling on fucking Jin, though? Yeah, we should probably leave, actually. Alright. Remember AD carry in 2016, buddy? I don't think so. I don't th Oh, no, it's 2017. The, the memes are crushing generations, I'm sorry. Oh, you're- you're so fucking gone. Remember my stun? That's fine. Watch as I- watch as you can see the face of not giving a shit, Akali. You like that face? It's about to happen to this Anivia. This is the face. This is the face. GGWP. That was a scarier game than I thought it was going to be, but we actually pulled it off. Hell yes! So I'm queued up for my game right now, and I kind of had a small thought. I'm thinking, I'm in silver now, right? I'm not playing in diamond or platinum or whatever I used to play it. I'm in silver. And in silver, I always remember that the early game tends to mean a lot more because a lot of times people don't know what to do when they're behind and then they tilt a lot to get really toxic. And there's a lot of different issues and problems where you can't succeed in the early game. And so I'm playing these champions, these high carry champions. Now, Camille is an exception because Camille is good both like early and late if you're strong enough as a champion. But like people like Fiora and Aurelia that take a little bit of time to ramp up and stuff. I mean, Fiora can do well in the early game too, but you get the, you get the point. They take some time to ramp up basically. Same thing with Poppy and stuff. So I thought, what if I try and play some champions that really kind of dumpster people in the early game and then play off that victory later? I might try a Jace or a York game now. All right, forget it. I got Camille. I'm okay. Masteries are pretty much as they come, except Bard has Bond of Stone instead of Thunder Lords, which is actually not something I see too often, especially Bond of Stone in general. It's just not something I expected on a Bard player, I guess. Everything else is pretty damn standard. Uh-oh, that's an invasion. Oh. Crap. Oh, well, Misfortune has the extra kill, which is a problem. It is spooky, but I do like the fact that we can go ahead and take this red buff right out of Gragas' hands would be really nice for Volibear. I'm a little bit worried right now. I feel like Riven's gonna take some form of cheeky flash attack on me. That's exactly what I was worried. Oh my god, as it happens. All right, bot lane's about to have a crazy day. God damn it, Edgereal is on a killing spree. This entire video is just gonna be Bricky carried by his teammates 101. Granted, I did pretty well as Aurelia last game, like after some hiccups in the early, but... Still. God damn it, they got another kill bot lane. Holy shit, I am so impressed. I have ultimate, we're gonna do our usual cheeky roam down mid lane. And we're gonna do our best to completely crush on this Lux. Didn't know if I needed that, wasn't sure, thought mm, maybe she still has flash and I want to keep her away. Doesn't matter though, the ability was used, we got the mid lane kill. Uh, I don't think Riven's gonna be a push excessively hard, at least not too much to the point where it bugs me. No. Yes. Yes. Oh, as soon as I saw the, the cannon turn around, I was like, oh, the minions will do this for me. 
Bricky carried by teammates. Bricky carried by minions. If I'm not on someone's back, how am I supposed to win? God damn, bot lane, what are you doing? You're four and one and one and like oh five and oh my god, it's ten to three right now. Do it, come on, do it. That's right, come on, get under my tower ribbon. Do it so I can ult you and laugh my ass off as you take a year's worth of goddamn tower shots. I want it to happen. You can't handle the increased damage that comes from me, Riven, because then you try and stop me. Oh crap, she might she might stop me. I'm out of mana! No! The amount of times Zillion has just stopped moving for some reason really makes me think he's uber toxic. Oh hey, what's up? <laughs> well look at you! It's not what? The fuck? Sorry, someone started calling me on Discord. I forgot that you could do that. You know, it's kind of funny, whenever I hear someone who's like, oh my god, report like mid and bot or like top and mid or anything like that, I always instantly think to myself, I should probably report them because obviously they're the ones who are being kind of a dick. See, now we're having a decent discussion in this chat. It's like, even this Riven, even this Riven's like, don't report for bad games. Why, why is the Riven the rational person? What the fuck? Oh. 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 Oh, this is looks this looks fun. This looks like everything I've ever wanted in a fight. Mm. Yeah, she's definitely dead. Oh, can I get a flash ult onto this guy? No, I can't. Oh, but I can do this though. <laughs> I t by any means, you don't get to- Oh shit. Yeah. I actually lost a lot of health there. I'm trying to go in that hard. I actually want to see where the Gragas is going to be coming from because... Found him. Yeah, I kind of want to just get rid of this... Fuck. I can't move. Just get him. Okay. Oh god. Can you, okay, it's just Lux and Israel and- oh, no, you should be totally fine here. Yeah, you should- you should be able to- uh, maybe not? Maybe, I don't know, I don't know what's going on. I got Triforce though, I'm also 666, so you know I'm the devil. Oh, it's just Bard- oh, no, but it's Riven left. Oh shit, it's Riven left. I expect- I expect him to be collapsed on, yep. Ah. Oh, I didn't realize he got Zillion ulted. Fucking true damage is a thing that exists in League of Legends. Oh, I didn't think she'd go back. Uh-oh! Why would you walk into that? Why would you walk into me? Okay, this is probably Baron. We should be okay. But I can see Lux and her sweetheart there. What the hell? Oh my god, true damage. Jesus Christ. Excellent. This is post nerfs. Post nerfs Camille. What a fun, balanced champion. Oh my good golly gosh. Do a dance. Do a mastery level 7. Span. Ah. Oh, just. I. God damn. Feels good, man. Well, that's, uh. That's pretty much it. Yeah. All right. We have like 85 LP or something. So gold. All, we pretty much just need to get into the promos. I might get into the promos off camera and then do the promos on camera. You know, that do one of those kinds of things. But regardless. Thank you all very much for watching the... I was about to say the stream. It's not a stream. It's not a stream. It's, it's a video. Thank you very much for watching this episode of the Road to Gold. Or Golden Brick Road. Yep, that's the one. This is episode three. And we're goddamn close. Hopefully we can just... We can stop with the memes. Alright. Bye-bye.